Hello, welcome to my channel. Today is exactly what the title says it is, and it is the behind the scenes of making my podcast. Doing a podcast was something completely like out of my comfort zone. I've never done anything like it or made anything like that. It was definitely a different experience, if that makes any sense. I don't, I don't know, I'm making it sound very dramatic. It was just like kind of different for me to completely change courses into a big podcast by myself especially because although I love talking to the camera it's so much easier and kind of better to bounce off of another person. The whole story of why I decided to make a solo podcast can be talked about in a different video or podcast episode. The actual making of the podcast I had to be honest with myself I'm like Hannah did you, do you really want to do this? If you're gonna do it, you're gonna have to put your all in so that it can actually succeed. Um, since I don't have a, like a million subscribers to base it off of, or enough subscribers to be like, oh yeah, let me tell you guys that I'm starting this podcast and everybody will go over to it. No, like I have to start essentially from scratch, you know, like zero subscribers and kind of build up that way. I decided to kind of make the process into a video. So it starts off with the name obviously. You need a name, you need to be able to build a brand on something that people can easily remember and this kind of goes back to talking with other people about doing a podcast together. The thing about doing a podcast with multiple people is you both have to be willing to put your all in and you know be able to make a schedule of recording editing, uploading, you know, you need that schedule and that means that you would have to change your entire normal schedule around to just be all in on a specific project. So when I was first thinking about a podcast, I was talking to my friend Zoe, you'll see her throughout the video, and I talked to her about having a podcast together and we both came up with the name, Basically Blonde, more so like, I say it was her idea but it was more so both of our ideas because we were talking about it at lunch at, oh gosh, I think it was Chili's and we were just brainstorming names and basically blonde came up and I was like that's perfect we are both blonde it'll work it'll work great now I need to make the account so that I know that I can upload them to certain social media sites so I made the Instagram page I made the TikTok page I made the YouTube page and the Spotify page I tried to make a logo yeah. not the best logo but I knew that Zoe and her brother were going to do a little like headshot photo shoot for it. And so I just needed something to, I don't know, give me like a little set. Like just be able to know like, okay, this will become what I want it to become. Then the next step of course was to get an actual microphone because I tried with voice memos and although voice memos is good for like starting off, it's just hard to get your phone at the right distance where it'll pick it up and actually sound like a microphone. So at first I was having it on my knee and that would pick it up okay, but like it just wasn't really fitting. So I looked up a podcast microphone and I found one on Amazon for $32. I look like an absolute mess right now, but this came in um, and I'm going to open it. Okay, so I bought the Zeal Sound Professional Studio Microphone. We're gonna see how it works, and I'm really excited. This was like $32 off of Amazon. I'll link it down below if you guys are interested in a microphone. It comes with the instructions and a warning. Um, it also comes with an adapter, a little plug-in adapter. So I'm gonna be plugging this into my computer. Um, and then this is how the microphone comes. It, this is a little bit like squished together, but that's okay. And then, ah. So overall, I'm pretty happy with the microphone. It seems to be working for that cheap price, so can't complain. I just need to figure out how it's going to sound on a, an actual episode. I was very happy with how that turned out, and although it's like a cheap microphone, it's it's good for like the beginning aspect of the podcast so I'm not gonna complain about it um, I did have to download Audacity Odyssey I'm not sure how to pronounce it but I did have to download that and it works great for recording audio so I don't even have to worry about that I also had to figure out a way to get my camera to continue recording after 15 minutes because for some reason it would just shut off after that quickly figured that one out the only thing I'm still kinda working on 
with my camera is for it to stop being so fuzzy when I'm doing the podcast. Like, whenever I'm recording a video like this or a different kind of video, it's the quality is fine. I just don't know why with the podcast itself it makes the the video all fuzzy. I think it's lack of light or something like that, so I'll have to to fix that. Now that I had the name, the accounts, the microphone, and the equipment to record the actual podcast, I was able to do a photo shoot with Zoe and make a headshot for the actual podcast. Okay guys, I am currently on my way to Zoe's house and there we're going to do a little photo shoot for the podcast and the little podcast cover. I'm so excited. We're gonna go on the beach and it's gonna be like golden hour and it's gonna be so fun. I'm so excited and I was gonna bring you guys along to show you our process and what it's gonna look like. So I'm so excited. This is Zoe. Hey guys. Thank you. This is Zach. My brother. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I don't know if it's still recording. We're done with our photo shoot. Say thanks, Zach. Thank you, Zach. Hi, I showed that um, those series of clips in about gosh, I don't even know three of my recent videos. So if you guys want to go see the actual promo for the podcast you can check that out and then if you want to see like kind of the behind the scenes of it that would be in my last video as well so go check those out and you can see what the pictures came out to look like now i had a, a logo kind of set up then i just needed a place to actually record it my room right now is kind of bare and there's nothing on the walls there's not really like a cute place to sit i'm I'm cleaning it so we're gonna pretend like there's not clutter right over here where you guys can't see. I just needed a place to actually record it. So I decided to use my mom's guest room until I can get like a cute little place to, to record, maybe with multiple people. Okay, so I made it into my mom's guest room. This is gonna be the backdrop for now until I can find like a studio or some a studio. Until I can find like a better backdrop um for the podcast. But now I'm gonna set everything up and then start recording just so exciting it's the first episode um by the time you're seeing this the episode will already be out it's about the barbie movie and just my take on the barbie movie even though it was like it came out like a month ago i still just wanted to talk about it a little bit um the next week episode is going to be a little bit more maybe a little bit controversial controversial but it's still going to be fun so i'm going to set up the podcast stuff. My friend Zoe gave me the ring light and um, I've also got another tripod here for my camera and I'm so excited. <laughs> So I just finished with the first episode. Um, it was so good. I probably rambled on a little bit, but you know, the first episode is always just like the trial and error. It's a error, and so I hope that it will turn out good. I have a better plan for next episode, so that one will probably be better. But you know, just as a first starter one, I think it'll be good. So so go subscribe to it. Go go listen to it, and if you absolutely hate it. Just give me time, you know? It was only the first episode. I'm still, I've only got 10 subscribers so far on that YouTube channel, so go ahead over there and subscribe to it. But now I have two videos up, and if you want to go check those two podcast episodes out, please do. 
And I hope you guys enjoyed the little behind the scenes of how I made my Basically Blonde podcast. Podcast episodes come out every Friday, and if you follow me on my Basically Blonde Instagram and TikTok, you will see little little clips of the episode before it comes out. So please go follow me on there. Go follow me on my main account. Subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.